that's the intro to Chris Ledoux's This Cowboy's Hat. I um, had a request to do a lesson on it. I'll show you the intro and then I'll show you the chords. I'll show you a couple different ways to do it. One being the picking pattern, one being the strumming. So the intro. The intro is basically doing an arpeggio through an A minor chord. Um, so I'm, I'm, I'm assuming you know most of your chords, so I'm not going to take the time to do that. I'm going to just go give you the run through. I am capoed on the third fret because my guitar is tuned down a half step. If you are playing in standard tuning, then you can put your capo on the second fret. So just to clear that up. Um, the intro, basically out of your A minor chord. You'll start by picking fifth string. When you get down to the second string, you're actually going to play that open. All the notes are going to be mainly in between your pinky and your index finger. That's where all that, that picking comes from. Um, to play it, you start on the fifth fret and you'll work your way down. When you get to the second string, that's when you'll hammer on with your index finger. Then you'll go to your E string, um, E string open. Then you'll come back up to the second string with your pinky. Then back to the E string. Then you'll do the walk down from the pinky to the index to the open. So hopefully that's clear enough. I know I don't really don't have a good camera for you. that's pretty much it you'll do that two times there's a few more notes in there that you could throw in but for a beginner this is pretty simple I'm just trying to keep it simple so let me do it one more time you'll start with the A minor you will walk down you hit the second string open then you got the E string open so let's, let's see if I can, I'm hoping I can get this clear for you just the way I do it. Um, pretty simple. Just arpeggio through that A minor, then doing some hammer-ons and pull-offs with your pinky and your index on that B string. Um, then it gets into the verse and the chorus. Um, the chords you'll need for the verse are A minor, E minor, G, back to A minor. You'll do that two times. I, when I sing it, kind of difficult to sing and do the arpeggios at the same time so I kind of strum and of course when you get to that A minor you're going to play it two times back to back because you start on A minor and you end on A minor so again it's A minor E minor G A minor then you do it again A minor E minor A minor, G back to A minor um, on the third part of it, it changes up a little bit. You'll go A minor to C to D, then A minor, E minor, A minor. And that's the run through for the verse. Uh, you, that's for the same for all the verses. Now I just strum. It's kind of a down, 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 up, down. Excuse me. Down, 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 up, down. Now, it sounds a lot better with the arpeggio. Um, starting out on the A minor, if you play the arpeggio, it's just four notes. You're going to start on the fifth string in an A minor, and you play those four strings. Just your four center strings. You don't play the top string, and you don't play the bottom string. Then you go to the E minor and do the same thing. With the G, you play the top string, play the six, five, three, excuse me, six, five, four, two. Then back to A minor, five, four, three, two. 
So it's five four three two five four three two six five four two five four three two. If you want to play the arpeggio, and I'll play that one time with it like that. Then it goes to the second part where it's one of motorcycle riders. C. That's a little bit different. You do the A minor the same. Uh, 5, 4, 3, 2. C. 5, 4, 3, 2. Then D minor. It's 5, 4. So you walk down on the D minor and back up. A minor, E minor, A minor again. Um, the main thing is just remember A minor, it's 5, 4, 3, 2. E minor, it's 5, 4, 3, 2. G, it's five, uh, 6, 5, 4, 2. Uh, C, it's 5, 4, 3, 2. Then D minor, you walk down and up. It's actually 5, 4, 3, 2. One, two, three, four. It's on that D minor down and back up. Um, that's it for the verses. Then when you get to the chorus, um, I guess you could strum it again, or I mean you could do the arpeggio, but when you actually start singing, you can strum it. It's A minor, you'll ride a black tornado to the western sky. Um, A minor, C, D minor. A minor, C, E minor. Pulled off the Mississippi, then it's ears down flat. Long before you take this cowboy's hat. Uh, so on the chorus, you got A minor, C, D minor for two counts. A minor, C, and E minor for two counts. And A minor. C and D minor for two counts. And A minor and E and A minor. And that's pretty much the whole song. Um, like I said, you could do the arpeggios during the verse or you could strum the verse. I strum it and when I sing it just because it's easier to strum and sing than it is to arpeggio and sing. Um, the arpeggio sounds better. Um, basic chords. Capo on the second fret if you're in standard tuning. I'm on the third fret because I'm tuned a half step down. Uh, pretty simple chords. Uh, hope it helps you out. Enjoy.